Hey guys, this is Alex from 4 Training and today let's check out EOS USDT. Okay, so um, we recently had a trade on XRP. We actually got two trades on XRP and it was like after two months because XRP just didn't show us any signs of reversal. So we had to wait like two months for us to get a fill on it or should I say to even get a potential trade on it, right? And we got it and both of them were filled and both of them are performing quite amazingly. We released that video a couple of days back, right? And now it is time to jump on another one of the main coins, right? <coughs> and um, I was looking at this area right now and I've had this area for quite a while right now. I think it was before or even, I mean, a little bit after, after BTC started pumping. And it's been there for like 106 days or something. So basically we have now came right back on top of this area. So now we have a little opportunity here to take a trade on it, right? Um, and in this case, since we kind of created the structure and let's just say Bitcoin and Ethereum now looking really bullish, uh, we have good chances of filling our shorts right on the top. If you still remember 9.5, right? 9.6, we're still uh, waiting for the shorts for like a two a month or something or right now. Um, so right now at this area, I'm going to make it just a little bit higher. I'm not going to move this one because this one is quite important, but I'm going to make this area just a little bit higher. And I'm gonna push this, uh, push this long a little bit further, right? I mean, I'm gonna a little bit higher actually. Uh, let's just see what kind of stop are we dealing with. We are dealing here with 3.5% stop, which is pretty good stop. I cannot be a hater. And yeah, we we'll practically keep here the first profit target, maybe just a little bit lower, just a little bit. First profit target, and then the la the second profit target, and then obviously, like we always go. If it breaks it, we go f to fill it in again. There's no point in having a third profit target here. Although it can break out, right? Um, so yeah, I, probably if the BTC is going to continue uh, to pump like this, hopefully it won't go uh, past 9.6k. That would be kind of... That would I kind of screw up the things again. But if it's going to be pumping, like in a slow manner, then we can probably see on USDT contract some upside. So... We will have to go a little bit aggressive on some trades, uh, right? So we don't miss them, but you know, we already got a couple of them out and we will probably do a couple of them more this week. So we'll see what happens, right? So keep following us guys. And yeah, thank you for watching and see you next time.